Yo, yo. Yo, hey. Wait. We're not in the apartment. We're outside. Wait, we haven't been here in like a year. It's Last time we were here, we got a million views for breathing in air. Breathing in air. Wait, where's that at? Can I breathe in some more air? I have gotten both shots, guys. I'm fully vaccinated. The CDC says you can go outside without a mask if you have fully vaccinated. So, well, I'm good. But I got one shot. One shot. Okay, so I can like, you get like halfly, like, like this. There you go. Because then this is one half, the other half. You stupid. Let me be safe that way. Okay. We're watching a movie today. We're going to see The Book of Saw. If you guys don't know what that is, it's basically like, I don't know who Jigsaw is. It's a famous clown, scary, yada, yeah. yada, yada. It is terrifying. If approached by security personnel, please be ready to show proof of age. And I hope you enjoy your evening. The thing about Universal Studios, it's cool and stuff, but they be overcharging for everything. The water's we got, here like five bucks. We got three hot dogs and it was like 80 bucks. And the hot dogs were not that good. The place was called Pink's. Overrated. Since things are opening back up, things are getting a little bit safer. Vaccines are rolling out. A lot of stuff is opening up again, including this iFly indoor skydiving. If you guys want to see us go on the skydiving indoor, we really want to do a real life skydiving. I've, I've done never it done it. Rob's done it. You haven't done it. No, Ryan hasn't done it. I don't think Ryan will do it. <laughs> yeah, Ryan won't Ryan do it. it. 20,000 likes will get Ryan to skydive. He will be forced to skydive. We will drag him out of bed and bring him on the plane. When's the last time we had fun, Rob? I don't know. That's what I'm saying. We need to do the indoor skydiving. This is fun. This will be like a warm up to get you used to the actual so real life actual skydiving. skydiving. Now, what if the fans turn off? Well, we won't worry about that. Uh, now, another thing, Universal City Walk, we gonna be here a lot, just saying. So if you guys ever wanna run into us, I'd say like Friday, Saturday. Bubba same. Gump's fire, we're eating there. They got some Cinnabon and stuff, so. And we just we'll met some of y'all out here right now. We're probably here right now as you're watching, so. Like, she from Spain, hold on, speak no English, but she know about the game. Book a flight, I'm feeling like I'm ready for the fame. We're here at Hit Sugar. He knows magic, he's right at the front. All right, so for this trick, each card has a value. Ace is one, two is two, three is three, Four is five, keep that in mind. What? We're gonna deal from the top here, unless you do a cut. Cool. So we're just gonna go straight from the top like that. It goes like that, so we go nine, and we go all the way up to 13. So 10, 11, 12, 13, and we go again. 12, 13, two. I don't understand, bitch, I don't understand. I want each of you to point to one of these piles. I'm gonna choose this pile, this one. Okay. <laughs> Stop the cap. All right, so I'm gonna take this one. This one, so I got more than half the pile here. Is that enough to work with, right? Yes. I'm gonna get rid of 10 of these. Two, three. What the fuck is going on? I want each of you to pick one of the three piles you chose earlier. I'll pick this I'll pick. one. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's these two left. One, two, three, four. Three cards in my hand. Now, wouldn't it be amazing if the amount of cards I had matched the value of the card you guys didn't pick? That would be cool. Three cards, you watching? So three, what the heck? Welcome to Sugar, guys. Thank you for stopping by. Thank I guess you might have to buy something. We gotta get something. Yeah. Because <laughs> Rhino. He he's at home. We're about to watch a scary movie. He's not a fan of the scary movies. Like so. Tell him I said hi. Uh, well, tell him right there. You can tell him if you want. What's up, Rhino? What's up, Rhino? What's up, Rhino? We'll bring him out next time. Gang, nice meeting y'all. Since I am the sweetest guy ever, this is a perfect store for me to be in. So I might have to get something. <laughs> <laughs> Rob beat me on that one. Ryan loves sweets, so I need to find something that he would like. Let's surprise Ryan with some candy. What do you think about this? The wacky packages? This is frightening. He's not gonna get this. Oh, maybe a Bob Ross drink? Bruh. Cause think about it, it, ha it does get hot in our apartment like sometimes. So when you have this, you're able to have like a nice breeze on the go. It's multi-purpose. Like oh, you can facts. also use it for a fan. You use it for just a toy to play with this little dog. And you can eat it. So it's like a three in one. A three in one. So this might be a good one. Now tell me who would buy pickled cotton candy? This gotta be the stupidest flavor. Do you notice how the green area is the most filled? Because that's the pickled. <laughs> Cotton candy, birthday cake, normal flavors. Who using cream though? Wait a second. Ryan does like cotton candy. I might get him this. Ryan likes sweetest fish. I know that. Oh, he does. We get him a candle. So in Spain, hold on, speak no English, but she know about the game. Look up loud, I'm feeling like I'm ready for the fame. What do I know? All I line them. I thought they didn't make these anymore, but apparently you found them. And it's almost. I haven't had any, but whatever. So I don't think I even was a fan of these growing up. I'm just trying to demonstrate the simple 
fact of how I eat the cereal. Milk first, boom, and then I pour these little guys in there. Boom, boom, boom. Gotta get get. And they rest on top, and then you quickly eat them. The problem with putting the cereal in first, when the milk hits it, it starts to cover a larger portion and surface area of the cereal, causing it to get soggier faster. Oh, milk in, the, in first, and this and that. You like soggy cereal, and that's to say something about you. You got crunch? You got crunch, Rob? I do. But what if the soggy cereal is part of the cereal experience? So that's an experience I want to be a part of. Mm -hmm. Fair to say. What is good soggy? Anything? Like when your pizza's soggy. Ew. Soggy cake, soggy cereal, soggy God knows what. <laughs> Oz! That's saggy. What? <laughs> Sorry. You can have like soggy nipples technically. Daddy. Ew, what? Like if they're well, soaked in water or something? Just when they're soft. That wouldn't be so soggy though. Soggy something would have to be wet. Can you be soggy if you're in the pool for too long and your fingers off? Soggy fingers. No, you're right. If you take like a bath, I'm guessing your nipples could get soggy. Soft would be a better word. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know why the f said that. But she's Oreo O's getting to me. Making me act up. Uh so yeah, that's that's how I do it. I just go little by little and pour it in there. So if you guys want to join me, let me know. Put in the comments that you're joining the Hashtag milk first. Hashtag milk first. It's a tight knit community that we have here. We're a lot happier over here. You notice how angry people get when you do the milk first? Bro, we don't act like that. We're calm over here on the milk first side. Guys, it's the next day. You saw that we went to go watch Saw. We saw Saw. We saw Saw. Okay. Ryan didn't come because it was too scary for him. Why don't you like scary movies? So I like this thing. It's called like fun. I think people find fun in getting scared though. I remember this girl was my first girlfriend, junior year of high school, and she wanted to watch The Conjuring when she came over. And I was like, Sure. Um, yeah, yeah, I love that movie. If you would think of 23 year old Ryan is scared of scary movies, imagine how f scared I was at 16. So I, I pulled up The Conjuring, scrubbed through it before she came, and um, <laughs> so, I never told anyone this. Scrubbed through it, saw the scary parts. <laughs> Okay. And then when she came over and watched it, then I wasn't scared. And I was like, what the fuck? I don't care. Brian has all the life hacks today. I don't do roller coasters. I don't do no haunted houses. Boring. Bro, who wants to do this? <laughs> I don't want to do that. Well, I didn't do that, but. <laughs> Some people are like adrenaline thrill seekers and I'm more of like a calm land mammal, sun basking, calm happiness. In honor of you missing the fun events that we had the other day, we wanted to get you something in return. Oh, thank you. Oh, it's just called It's Sugar. My type of place. Oh, let's go. Oh. <laughs> it might be good. I said, mmm, this looks like some apple cotton candy. Okay, pickles. And I'll have you know that I hate pickles. Okay, well, they didn't give me all gross stuff, obviously. They got me some nice. You know, it gets hot in your room sometimes. <laughs> Where's the candy? In here? We didn't figure that part out. <laughs> cool candy. It's, we still don't know what it is. It's cool. Paw Patrol. I don't know what the f that is. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Not bad. And you just fill it up in there. You can stay cool and eat some nice treats. That I decided to throw in there because it's like a surprise little ball. <laughs> Damn, y'all really went out of your way to slice me here. <laughs> Stuff. Whoa, 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 whoa. I was not expecting that. I know y'all didn't give me crickets. No, but look at they're bacon and cheese and sour cream and onion crickets. They're meant to be eaten. Since we got them for you, you have to try them. I feel like that's what they give you in hell when you get to the gates. And y'all also got me the cookies and cream. Yeah, that one. Yeah, that was sort of something that you might. Yeah, have we knew you weren't gonna like that one. Let me, I'm gonna try that one right now just to see because I ain't never heard of no shit like that. Yeah, we also got that for you too. No, why'd you put the popcorn? <laughs> Weird. Dude, I spent a lot of money on that. It lacks like a, ri cream. a richness. <laughs> it, it lacks the cookies and cream flavor. It tastes like cotton candy, not cookies and whatever. I feel like it's the closest thing you could get to cookies and cream cotton candy. So this can't be bad then. Oh God. There was a motherfucker in my elementary school who smelled like this. Y'all ain't never seen a green cotton candy. Oh, it's terrible. At the end, it's okay. Oh. Oh, you shouldn't taste like that. Y'all need to be sued. Who made this? Someone who likes pickles. Y'all bought it, so someone made it well, a little profit. We bought it for you. Yeah, so, here so you go. it's not our problem anymore. I think you can like collect them, so this will start your mini brands collection. Holy shit. Oh, the aftertaste on this. God awful. Blech. Lock this up. <laughs> See, I don't like doing things like, oh, jelly belly bean. Ooh, this one tastes like fucking <laughs> eggs. Bro, I just want a good tasting jelly like, bean. Like, let me know what I'm eating. Whoa, yeah. kind of cool. Pick your slice. Oh, I got surprises. What's that? 
Jesus. What the? Oh, is that any candy? Is this a mini piece of cheese? The Laughing Cow original cheese wedges. So there's not actually cheese in this. No. This is like a little toy. They're like mini foods that you could collect, I think. Or mini things. Oh, so I don't actually get to eat it. Nope. You just gotta look at it and stuff. Oh, I look, but it <laughs> look at this. Two little knickknacks. Baker's dipping chocolate. There's somebody out here that does this for a living. What do you do? I make my tiny foods and shit. <laughs> Sweet relish. Like a little collectible. Puts it in the fridge. Y'all got any relish? Yes, yeah, down there. <laughs> yeah, well, we got about a no, serving. Like, oh, this is hard. Feta cheese. Feta cheese. Craft cheddar cheese. When you're on a diet. <laughs> Has calories, 110. That's the world's smallest font. Hey, here's all the ones you can get. Oh, shit. Damn. Oh, I want to get like a little bag of chips. That'll be hard. The Old Bay, too. Awesome. I'm going back there to collect some more. See, we're spicing up the vlogs a bit. Which one was the best? I mean, the fan does came with candy and air conditioning. What are you supposed to do with this? I don't know. Like... Look at this. It's Paw Patrol. <laughs> Just... <laughs> I fuck with the little foods the most. And guys, we didn't try the crickets because you guys saw us try everything else. But if this video gets 50,000 likes, we'll eat this in the next vlog. Yeah, I need y'all to blow up this video and like it. Otherwise, I'm not eating that. Because there's no point then. I need an incentive. Yeah. I'm not just going to eat this just to eat this. Gross. Like the video right now. Go now. Bye.